the biggest obstacle to moving to a fully value-based model is that no one's paying on that right now. Um, even if you have a, a great payer contract with a enlightened uh, health plan that wants to move from volume to value, that's only one health plan. And there's still a lot of different health plans in your market. And there's still Medicare in your market. And there's still Medicaid in your market. And while they're all paying on different systems, principally on a fee-for-service basis, it's really hard to move your system. It might be irrational to move your system too fast. And so I think the job is to move in not baby steps, but in a measured steps. Steps that take into account changes in your payer contracts, changes in your population, what's happening on the state level for Medicaid, what's happening on the federal level for Medicare, and then trying to tweak the incentives of the other parts of your system, management as well as the providers, so that they're pulling in the same direction as these contracts. And having rewards and incentives that follow those contracts is obviously critical.